what's going on? Today we're talking about the new Fury AB 5000s with applied ballistics. But before we do that, we better let you know that Vortex does sponsor us and they did send us these optics. But they do not get to approve or deny what we say here in this here review. They want our true and honest opinion on these bad puppies, and that's what you're gonna get. Thanks for tuning in. Please drop down and hit that like button and subscribe. And let's dive into it. Bad Mamma Jammas are brand new. January 7th of 2021, they were announced and launched, and they are awesome. If you guys are familiar with the Vortex range finding binocular line, they started out with just the Fury HDs, and then they moved up to the Fury HD 5000s, and this is very similar to this pair right here. But new for 2021, Vortex integrated with Applied Ballistics, which is the ballistic calculator that you can also pair with a Kestrel wind meter which is awesome so now these bad mamma jammas bluetooth to this here kestrel which also bluetooth to this here smartphone to this fury hd app meaning you can load your firearm your environmentals your ballistics display and then your target parameters and it's hard to read upside down so these things are just awesome like mind-blowingly awesome a lot of new features are integrated into the brand new 2021 applied ballistics fury 5000 so we're going to dive into those and kind of show you how we connected to our smartphone you load your firearm your loads which i'm shooting the 168 burger vlds out of my 7mm so that's what i was just doing prior to this video but it's very cool that uh you can get active wind measurement readings right here on your fury 5000 so Let's talk about a little bit of specs. Just like last year's, they are capable of ranging out to 5,000 yards on reflectable targets. If you're dropping down to non-reflectable, we're talking on a deer, 1,600 yards, on a tree, 2,400 yards, and then on a reflective target like the roof of a building or something like that. If you have a buddy out there holding a mirror, you might be able to hit that at 5,000 yards. Close focus, 18 feet. Uh, eye relief 16 millimeters, weight 32.4 ounces on these. They're pretty substantial. They're pretty, they're pretty heavy. But uh, with that being said, it's very ergonomically friendly. I like, I like how they feel in the hand. They got a very tacky um, rubber surface, or it's very grippy, and I'm, I'm liking that. I'm liking how they feel in the hands. It feels great. So they will fit in a, a small, medium marsupial gear bino harness. Um, they are eight ounces heavier than the Viper uh, HD 10 by 42. So with all these uh, extra guts and gadgets and gizmos inside of these things, only eight ounces, uh, pretty doable for that. The buttons are, you know, there's lots of buttons on this one because we do have the applied ballistics. The menu seems like it's uh, fairly easy to use. Jacob just paired it to my blue, my phone in about two minutes. So uh, it's very easy. The app, I'll just show you what the app looks like. It's just a Fury HD icon. You can see that one right there. That's the, Fear, the Vortex Fury HD. And then you pop that open and then it was very easy to pair your device. So then you went through, we just paired the Kestrel and then we paired the, the Fury 5000s. And then if you go into firearms, you go down here and then you click the gun vault, add firearm, and now you get to add all of your data. And then this bad mamma jamma, you can just have your buddy watching your phone you range and then shapow, uh, you're getting all of your bullet drop data, your ballistic, your MOA, your MRAD, all kind of your adjustments to make that shot in a quick jiffy with all this new technology. Stuff's getting crazy. I'm liking it. We're going to dive deeper into these once we hit the range and we get to get hands on 
with the Furies uh, and the app and the Kestrel and kind of pair them all together in just a, a giant sandwich of awesome technology. They do come in at $1,500. Now let's move on to the glass inside of the Fury 5000s. It is a uh, 10 by 42 and the glass within the Furies are very similar to the Viper lineup. If you guys are familiar with the Vortex lineup, you got Diamondbacks, uh, Vipers, Razors, Razor UHD. Um, so they, they, they're very compatible with the, the Viper lineup of like clarity and, and that kind of thing. So the linear, linear field of view at a thousand yards is 321 feet, which is pretty typical for like a 10 by 42. We uh, are planning on getting these out in the field and getting hands on and kind of seeing what they're truly capable of. Is the 2400 uh, range on a tree accurate? Is the 1600 yard range on a deer accurate? And can they hit that 5000 reflective? Uh, we will definitely find out and get back with you guys and kind of do um, a mid-season update after we have been using these um, throughout the spring bear, throughout um, like this July and August scouting season and uh, maybe into the fall bear or something. But we are definitely going to circle back and tell you guys uh, what we find, how we like them. And, and uh, we're, we're super excited to play with the new app that they are offering, get our loads dialed up on this thing, and then uh, kind of see what they got. So that is it for now. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, please head down to the comments and let us know what you think. Are you going to pick a pair up? Did you like the Fury 5000s? Are you guys stoked for the capabilities uh, with the Kestrel and with the smartphones? Are you, are you excited to see where technology is leading us? Make sure to hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell to be notified uh, every time we drop a new video. And thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you next time.